Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Missouri with JC News Now as he attempts to film yet another dispensary, but this time gets arrested. Dude, what is your issue with these dispensaries? I mean, they are essentially on uh, areas that are private property, and you've been told that over and over again, but you still try it, and you ended up getting arrested this time. But hey, stupid is as stupid does, and well, Jimmy Boy, you are one of the dumbest frauditors I have ever seen, besides uh, Glenn Serio. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's up, y'all? I can go. Go down I'll here go. and uh, get a few pictures. Oh, by the way, uh, this video is almost an hour long, but like the rest of his videos, it's mostly dead air. And just like the rest of his videos, there's probably only about 10 to 15 minutes of usable footage because all he does there is acting like Jason Voorhees stand there and stare at people until he gets a reaction. Much like Glenn Serio used to be. So let's go ahead and cut to some of the more interesting parts, shall we? Because I don't think you want to see uh, a shit ton of dead air. 11 minutes later. Okay. I was just curious why you were recording my girlfriend. I'm not. I'm recording anything I can see in public. Okay. Yeah. Hey, how are you? You out here recording them? I'm recording. Okay. You're getting a little close. Well, it's private property. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It's private open to the public. Hey, douchebag. Do you even know what privately owned open to the public means? It basically means that it is a business that caters to anybody around there, whatever their needs are, you know, like Walmart or anything like that. Yes, Walmart is a privately owned business open to the public. But that just means that they can give you products, but if you uh, don't obey the rules of the store or the property, they can kick you out and trespass you and have you arrested. I worked for Walmart for about 10 years and i saw it every single day so your logic right here it just doesn't hold water i mean i know you're about to say that you can't be trespassed uh i don't even have to watch the video to know it because you keep on saying it so often but let's continue on and with your stupidity shall we <laughs> are we on tiktok too i've seen those yep oh me too <laughs> yep Huh? Yeah. Okay. I'm Tim Kelly on air on TikTok. Pardon? I'm at Tim Kelly on air. You need to follow me on TikTok. All right. I'll follow you, man. <laughs> That's smart. When you see the video, follow me, man. Hit me up. Say I'm the guy that come out of... All right. But no, seriously, it is private property, and we'll call the police if we have to. So we have to ask you to leave. You can call anybody you want. It's right. open to the public. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I'm I wouldn't. just going to take a quick picture of Okay. You. Take that with you. Okay, there we go. All right. I'm going to take a quick video. Okay. Hey, Good why deal. are you flipping me off? There's no need to flip me off. Well, it's that's... called a cam back. It's called a bam. I mean, that's really rude to flip me off. All right. Yeah. Yeah. You don't like the camera? Oh, no. I love the camera. I wasn't, I just... I wasn't recording your girlfriend, but I'm going is, to like, now. I came up all nice to you, just yeah. asking you what you're doing. I was just giving you a good video. Okay. Bet. All right. Jimmy boy, you should really understand that just because something is open to the public doesn't mean you can't be trespassed. And you found this out numerous times, yet you keep on doing this. But today you're about to get arrested for your stupidity. But in the meantime, let's go ahead and skip to the next segment because there's a lot of minutes between now and then. 15 minutes later. Is there something I can help you with? 
No, I'm doing good. Thank you. Okay, so um, we can't have people recording because, like, soliciting. What's your name? And why are you focusing on her crotch? If you're gonna film her, at least uh, pan up to her face because, well, you look like a pervert at this point. Ashley, I I don't believe that for HIPAA and stuff. HIPAA? Do you so know? Th this well, is a a medical. Yeah, and I just, I I, is there something I can help you with or No, anything? but I'll, I'll inform you that the onus is on you to protect information. I'm not part of the medical Correct. field. Correct, yeah, but just... So I don't have to obey it, but... Yeah, it's on them to protect the information of the patients, which is why your ass is going to be kicked off the property, trespassed, and arrested. But you never seem to get that. You never seem to understand the process. You're either thick-headed or extremely stupid. Okay, yeah, just out of courtesy, would you mind? Uh, when, when I get done, did y'all call the police? I haven't called anybody. I just, out of courtesy, I was curious if you oh. wouldn't mind to take a break. Sure. As soon as I finish my story, I'll get out of here. Fair okay. Fair enough. What news source are you with? I'm independent. Independent. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what's the story over? Well, uh, I can't t disclose that until it's published. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, I will have to ask you. I'm not trying to be rude. Right. And I understand if you're if you're trying to, but it is um, considered soliciting to be outside of a business and okay you can spin it however you want i'm, I'm not, not i'm not anything. i'm not selling anything i'm not asking for anything okay so i'm this... simply exercising my first amendment right to the freedom of press on, okay on... but this is private property right but you don't own it i can she may not own it but she still has renters rights and if she wants you trespassed she can have you trespassed or have you not learned that already from the last encounter that you had where one of the tenants of the previous dispensary had you trespassed and a little secret between you and me uh, you can be trespassed from any property dude and if you watch a lot of fraudulent videos you see that happens all the damn time well i guess it's not so much of a secret but well it's just that you seem to act like it's never happened before do you need the face of the person who owns it well if he comes out here and tells me to get off of it i will okay okay i can make that happen if that's what you need mm, okay up, up to you three hours later can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Hey, Jimmy, how are you? All right, how are you? Hey, not too bad. Can I keep your hands out of your pockets? I'm not detained. Well, right now, so you're in front of the store, just for, right. I can't see your hands, so you can all hang right. out there, you're fine. Okay. Jimmy, why are you recording now? I'm working on a story. Okay, what kind of story are you running? Uh, I'm not going to answer it until it's published. Okay, I get it. I'm sure there's a lot of competition for this kind of stuff. So is you guys together then? I don't, I'm not going to answer any questions. Okay. Well, Jimmy, here's the thing. So, this is private property. Open to okay. the public. It's a business, though. Open to the public. You this whole right. sidewalk is. So, Jimmy, here's the thing. So, you're kind of correct. So, this business is open to the public. Mm -hmm. You are right. But this business is a private business, right? And there are cartilagians at the door. What I did. The cartilagians at the door. I did my research. Okay. This sidewalk's open to the public to use. Okay. So here's the thing, I'm just passing a message along to you, yeah. okay? So this is private property. You're right, it is a public business where people can come and go and they can do whatever they need to do. But this private business also has asked that they don't want you on their property, so don't go into the store. I won't go in their store. Be on their business. Now, this whole separate property, mm -hmm. uh, what we'll do too, is they also don't want you on that property, okay? Okay. So although this is a sidewalk, this is different than that sidewalk out there. So if you want to go to that sidewalk in the grass, All go right. for it. Did the property, property, did the whole property owner trespass me? Yep. Did, who asked him? It doesn't matter. Who solicited the trespass? If you'd like. That matters. It that's a 14th Amendment violation. Uh, no, uh, the 14th Amendment does not protect you in this particular situation. I mean, the laws of the state still apply to your situation, and you are currently being trespassed because the owners of the property don't want you there annoying their customers. The fact is, you are wrong every time you open your damn mouth. What's your badge number? 19. 1918. So 1918. Just like you. 
I'm recording, and I was actually recording even before I knew I got here. So, are you here to enforce feelings or enforce laws? Laws. Okay. Well, the law says this is an ordinance. This is a city ordinance. Mm -hmm. So. Laws are a little separate. I mean, it's still under the mm -hmm. law. But, exactly. Um, like I said, I don't want you to be making this worse than it really needs to be. So, okay. you can record on that sidewalk over there. Mm -hmm. That's a public sidewalk. That's owned by the city. You're allowed to be there. Stay on the sidewalk. Do what you need to do. But this property, it's a private business. The so whole, the whole property, it's, it's or just these two businesses? Yeah. So this property right here is a little bit different. So mm -hmm. they're uh, obviously a marijuana dispensary. Mm -hmm. uh, with a business like that, they actually have ownership rights to extend beyond the business. And this is just passed along from the business owner. So mm -hmm. ultimately, what can happen is if the private business owner wants to pursue charges, which they do, mm -hmm. if you don't leave, uh, they are willing to sign a summons to go to court. Okay. So what that means. Is they'll have to go to court and then you will have to go to court. Right. That summons would be a chance for all this to get fought out. Okay. So if you'd like to record over there, uh, zoom lens, do whatever you need to do, let and me, you might be able to avoid some. Let me ask you a question. Yes, sir. Will you arrest me if I don't leave this publicly accessible sidewalk? It's public it's publicly accessible, but it's not publicly it's not publicly owned, just like that sidewalk. It's publicly accessible, though. That's the difference. That's correct. It is publicly accessible, but it is private property. Are you going to arrest me if I don't leave this publicly accessible sidewalk? Well, uh, why would we have to go that route? Well, I just need to know, because if you're not, I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing. But if you threaten me with arrest, I'm going to file a lawsuit against you okay. and take your qualified immunity from you, okay. and I'm going to sue the city. Okay. You frauders keep on threatening that, but rarely ever follow through. And when you do follow through, it's pretty much laughed out of court because you are in the wrong just about every single damn time. But so it's up to you, man. Don't you're not a feelings enforcer. No, I I have no feelings. All no. I have to do is when somebody says, "Hey, there's somebody on my private property who I don't want on my private property." It's not at a theirs. Point, it is enforcement. There, let, so what would be the difference? Their cartilage hey, ends at the door, right hey, there. Hey. Yeah. So here's the deal. Mm -hmm. I think he needs a drug test. There's a place down there to get a drug test. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just need to know if you say you'll arrest me if I don't leave, I will walk, buddy. Let's, no problem. Let's get it sorted. Okay. Right now okay. you are being detained, so you are not. Free I am leave. detained. Okay. You are 100 percent detained. What crime did I commit? We're investigating a trespassing. If you'd like to go back and forth about the property lines, I'm going to go off of good faith and Wait. say that you're not allowed to be here. I'm going off the homeowner. You see how these pylons are all painted? That's by the business owner. You're in front of this sidewalk. This is not a private property. Okay. Besides okay. all that. So right now you are being detained. Okay. You're not under arrest, but you're not right. free to leave while right. we're investigating this trespassing. You're okay? investigating a trespass. I haven't yes, been sir. trespassed. You don't have to be trespassed. Yes, you do, yes, sir. sir. You, you can only detain me if I come back. Nope. I'll, okay, I'll wait until it's sorted out. Hey, no worries. But like I said, you're not free to leave. All right. Okay. If I'm detained, I guess I'll keep my hands out of my pocket. I don't have any weapons. I appreciate it. Nothing. Nothing illegal on me. You don't seem me. like a violent guy. I'm not. Just maybe uh, maybe I'm, not clear on where things are at. So like I said, I'm very I'm clear. For... Uh, dude, you're not exactly clear on anything. In fact, you're not even properly educated on anything because everything you talk about is easily debunkable at this point. I mean, it is quite easy to just look up everything you say and uh, find out well that you're full of shit at this point but please continue on with your uh clarity uh media i'm all for making a good story I'm you know i know you guys were reporting a few other places which is good mm -hmm. you know when it comes out you'll have to watch it on your youtube okay yeah i'm very clear on it i don't think you're clear on the trespassing law okay first well, i got to be asked to leave and then if I don't leave, then it's a crime. So do you know, they, they changed the law a few years ago. Do you know the difference between first degree and second degree yes. trespassing? Yes. What is it? It's, I've read it all. Okay, what, what it? Okay, I'm not going to answer any more questions since I'm detained. Okay, I'm going to take your response as you definitely haven't read very much of it, if anything at all. So basically, I'm going to say, yeah. That you're a supreme case of the Dunning-Kruger effect. Just a little bit of knowledge gained and you think you know everything. But let's continue on. Oh, it means that. Hey, that is your right. Okay. Let me know when I'm free to go. I will. Like I said, we're going to have a few other officers come out here and we're going to help investigate this. But right now, you are uh, not free to leave. Okay. okay. All right. Just let me know when I'm free to go. 
five minutes later. That includes even identifying. I don't have to. Say, I don't have to say a word. Okay. Well, I, it, I'll to put it to you this way: under yes. threat of arrest. It's not a threat of arrest. Yes, it's he, just the the next progression that we have to go towards. But it, it's not a threat. Under, it's actually a fact. Under be arrested. That's it. That's all I need to hear. Okay. okay. I'm, where do you want to know? Just your name. Jimmy Haig. Okay. Let me write it down. Okay. Because okay. so I was gonna say we were gonna have to put right. you in handcuffs, take you to jail. Yeah. You know, we. I don't. You don't yeah. seem like you want to deal with that. You know. Yeah. You seem like a good guy. It's too hot out here to be messing yeah. with that kind of stuff. But you're wrong, sir. You're very wrong. I don't have to identify. You do have to identify. No, so you don't. Out. That's why I'm doing this. To train y'all better. You don't have to identify yourself if you're the suspect of a crime. The crime right now is trespassing. I haven't trespassed. You are trespassing Just on this private property. Exactly. No, it's not. This is private property. It's private, open to the public. This is private right. property. It's no different. What do you want like, me to know? We deal with this pretty often. I'm done with you. Like, you're dismissed. He's still going to be here, but you don't okay. have to talk to him. All right. All you have to do is give me your information. We can positively identify you. Okay. Mm -hmm. How do you spell your first name, sir? J I M M Y. Hey, Jimmy, how do you spell your last name? What's your first name? I don't have to give you that, Jimmy. Well, I'm willing to exchange. I'm willing to give it to you. Well, that's not how this works, Jimmy. I'm going to give you one more chance, okay? okay. Give All me right. your information, or you're going to go in handcuffs, and you're going to go to jail. Really? Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, it's Hague. How do you spell that? H-A-A-G. H-A what? A-G, two A's. A, okay. And Jimmy, what's your birthday? And your social? I'm not giving you that. Or your driver's license number. Okay. I don't have to give you that. Hey, Jimmy, you're under arrest. I'm under arrest? Yes, Jimmy. I, I have to give you my social. All right, can I give him my camera? You're under arrest. I'll hold it for a second. Okay. I'll let you put the camera under You want to keep recording? I'm going to give your phone to your friend so that way okay. you can keep recording this interaction, okay? Thank you. Here you go. What do I need to do here? I don't want to go to jail. Jimmy, I'm sorry, sir, but we've. Well now, stupid is as stupid does, and Jimmy boy, you certainly are one of the dumber ones out there. And besides that, I'm sure you've got a lot of privacy strikes incoming, because I know... I'm about to call another dispensary to make sure that they know they can privacy strike you. And I know Frauded Wrangler is going to be in on this too. But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.